and welcome. My name is Tolan and I'm the co-founder of Productivity Me. In this video, we're going to look at how to use the Alt Page Down keyboard shortcut in order to move one screen to the right. So with that, let's get started. Here in Excel, we have an example where we have a couple of tables and then to our right, we have just some random data. So in the next few videos, we'll look at how we could easily and quickly access or rather view that other screen of data. So one way to do this is if you want to move a single screen to your right, you can press the Alt key and the page or down key that would automatically zoom to the cells or the columns that were immediately to your right. So currently we have, let's say, we have the view where we have cells G through W. If we want to move to our right, we can of course use our scroll bar, scroll over, but it's actually a lot faster to just press the Alt key and the page or down key and you'll automatically have that same result, moving one screen to the right. So again, if we were here on our first screen and we wanted to move one screen to the right, we can press the Alt key and the page down key and it will automatically bump to our right. This is an alternative from the option of taking our mouse and the scroll bar, clicking on our scroll bar and zooming over to the individual columns on our right. I actually use this keyboard shortcut a lot. In the next video, we'll look at how to move one screen to your left by using the Alt Page Up function. And in the following two videos, we'll look at using the Page Up and Page Down function. The combination of these four keyboard shortcuts, that of Alt Page Down, Alt Page Up, as well as Page Down and Page Up, are incredibly useful when working with larger data sets. So again, in this video, we looked at using the Alt key and the page down keyboard shortcut in order to immediately jump to the screen on our right. This was an alternative to say, using our mouse and our scroll bar and manually dragging. So with that, join us in the next video and we will see you again soon. Thanks for watching.